Don't you touch that remote. The show is about to start. You should have grabbed your snack like five minutes ago. <sighs> oh well. Grab it anyway. It's big quick. And I know you've got your blanket. And I see you've got your tea. Or hot cocoa. I'm not sure what that is. You've got a drink. That's good. Just get comfortable. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Folks, welcome back to Travi J's Space here on YouTube. We're back to another episode of The Sims. OG, oh, The Sims 1, going back to 2001. Sorry, 2000 for this special Let's Play. Uh, gosh, that was 22 years ago. I was three <laughs> when this came out. So, good times, good times. We're jumping back into things here. As you can see, the beautiful town of... I don't know what town this is called. This is back before towns had names. So, we'll call it Pleasant View. This is the OG Pleasant View. <laughs> and we got lots of old neighbors. Oh wait, no one lives here. Oh, the Charming family. The cat family, okay, old cat lady. Bird family, we got all kinds of cool OG families here. Of course, our neighbors, we're playing as the, uh, newbies. And our neighbors are the Goths, who we've become acquainted with. And don't mind this random river in the middle of the street that seems to disappear as I hover the mouse, the cursor over it. Lots of glitches in this game, guys. Um, of course, I don't have the... Uh, I don't have the, uh, I don't know what I was going to say, <laughs> um, but it, we were in the middle of doing some renovation, so let's get into it, shall we? The last episode I noticed the audio was way too high. I've turned it down considerably, so I hope you guys can hear me better, but I'm going to take it down one more notch, or maybe not. Let's just, I'm just going to check my, my own sound here. There we go. That should be better. I think it right in the middle is probably good. Um, yeah. Okay. Yay. I just want to make sure everything's perfect. Okay. So, now we're going to build the house. I'm so excited. Are you so excited? Um, okay, the first thing we need to do is just make sure the outside of the house matches all the way through. I kind of like the brick they already got going on, but it would be cool to match our neighbors. And eh, no. Let's be original. Let's be very original. Um, 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 uh. See, and they don't categorize their wallpapers in the first one. I forgot about that too. <laughs> so it definitely makes it a lot more difficult <laughs> and uh, time consuming. Oh. Do they not have the brick? And one thing they don't have either is the eyedropper tool. I don't think. I'm not seeing it anywhere. No. Crazy, eh? This is OG. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay. We'll keep it. We'll keep it simple, you know? Let's not get too crazy. Okay. So, for the kitchen slash dining room, let's work on that, shall we? All right. So... I'm thinking for the walls. I actually don't know what I'm thinking. So, what's this? We gotta remember it's 2000, so we still got 90s styles that are relevant. Ooh, yeah, so let's make like an ultimate 90s living room. <gasps> Stop. We're doing a red brick, red brick kitchen. Or, sorry, red brick living room. I wanna make it like retro. Well, I guess modern in this day and age. Oh, I'm painting all over the walls here. Oh, I painted the bathroom. <laughs> I think I did that over here too. Yeah, I painted the bathroom. <laughs> or the bedroom or the bathroom. Oh, try me, Jay. Okay, so that's the living room. Let's get something for the kitchen. I'm not too picky, you know. 
this is great for a dining room. It's very like elegant and over the top. Kind of like me. <laughs> Blue. <laughs> you know it's true. Uh, oh, star wall. Cool. I think we're just going to go simple. Make it a little elegant. No, 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 no. You know what? I always do elegant, classical, uh, like historical looking homes. That's usually what I'm drawn to. I usually do like historical stuff or old fashioned looking homes, traditional homes. That's usually my, my build style. But I'm going to try to get out of my build style and try to do something modern chic. Modern chic, meaning, you know, we're in the 2000s here, so modern chic for the 2000s. Just so we're clear, in case you start wondering, what the hell, that ain't modern at all. Well, if it's 2001, then it is. Aw, we could do like a traditional country kitchen. No, but we'll clash with the modern. So let's keep it. That's cute too, but I don't like the green tile. They got another variation. Oh, blue tile. But blue and red clashed. <laughs> I guess we could keep the original kitchen pink. That would be so bad. Y'all see how picky I am? I am picky. I am picky, picky, picky. <laughs> Very picky. Oh, that's kind of cute. That's cute. No. I was going to say that's cute for a bedroom, but... I just feel like it needs to be... It'll hit me. It'll hit me. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. I think that's it. That's it. That's the one. Yep. We're going to do that for the kitchen. <sighs> See, now I don't like it anymore because it's got the... This reminds me of a hotel. It probably came with vacation. Same with this one. Oh, my gosh. Oh, a black kitchen? I like this idea. It goes with the red. Yeah. 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 Yep, it's going to happen. This is how we're going to do it. Oops. <laughs> I'm still getting used to all of this, so bear with me, guys. I'm still getting used to all the functions <laughs> and uh, the layouts. And it's literally like taking a trip back in time. Oh, black tile, too? Let's make them real bougie. Real modern bougie bitches. <laughs> Ooh, this is how I would rock in the 2000s. Oh yeah, anything goes. I still live in the 2000s, let's get real. <laughs> really, let's get real here. I, I never left the, the 2000s, the O's. Well, that's kind of cool. I like that, but I feel like... I feel like it should be wood. I don't know why I'm gravitated to that. Definitely not cement. We don't want cement floors in the living room. What the hell? Ooh, there's that. And now this is a carpet. I don't know if we want carpet, though. Do we want carpet in here? Yeah, why not? But a darker red, I think, would look more... Yeah. Oh, you know what? We can't move... We can't move the kitchen stuff because Bob's in the way. And Betty is in, or Bella, where is Betty actually? That's a good question. Where did she run off to? Oh, we got some stray animals in the street. A dog and a cat. Maybe we'll adopt them. Where did Betty go? Betty, hello. Hello. She's gone. <laughs> There's no Betty on the premises. Oh, where she is. What is she doing? <laughs> What is she doing all the way over here? <laughs> she must be getting real jealous. Oh, there's another stray cat. Oh my gosh. I guess we're gonna have to start adopting the stray animals in the neighborhood here. Might just have to happen. Okay, Bob. Get away from the sink. Yeah, you out the door, okay? Say goodbye. <laughs> Listen. Bella, I need you out of the house. I guess I could just pull out that sheet. Oh, look, maybe you should adopt this cat. Aristotle. Oh, that's a cute cat name. Oh, Betty, go say hello. I hope we can adopt this cat. That's that's my next mission. Oh, Bob. 
Okay, I think it's time we say goodbye to Ella. I know she's having a great time having fun. Turn off the damn TV and turn off the stereo. Oh! Bella's not a hugger. Duly noted. Which I shouldn't have just in case. Always gotta have notes ready. Okay, so now that you have- Oh, he's gonna turn on the- Wow, we're even back in time that there's no remotes for things. It's all manual. Oh! Betty! Okay. Sit and stay. Play with. Yeah! Become friends with him! You go over there, too. Oh, Tucker! Oh, We're adopting a dog and a cat today. <laughs> oh, look at them! Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? And a good girl. A pet again. Pet again. Oh, I hope we can. I hope we can adopt these stray puppies. Please, puppy dog. Aww. It was some loving. Over here. Oh, good. They're making good. Are they building relationships? Oh, good. Look at this. <laughs> this, <laughs> this cat's name is Aristotle Strays. <laughs> Sounds like a rapper. Yo, I'm Aristotle Strays. Uh, listen to my new track on iTunes. Pet. And praise. Why can't I praise the puppy? We want to keep you. We want to give you a home. Let us do that. Oh, I didn't even see this black cat. Oh, we can't adopt all of you. There's so many strays in this neighborhood. Holy. Now go pet her one more time. And Bob, I know you're uncomfortable, but we do, we do many things for the animals we love. That you will grow to love, Bob. I love you. It looks like my friend oh, Mr. Spider did not return. Mm -hmm. He's still up there somewhere. I don't see him anywhere. I usually do see him though. It's usually meant to be. <laughs> okay, good. They're out of the house. I have opportunity here. Oh, it's night out though. Oh well. Oh, we can make him work, right? First of all, someone should have done the dang dishes because... Oh. Okay. Alright, let's begin here. Maybe we should work on the windows first. That's what I'm thinking. We get rid of... Okay, this can just go outside. This do, this do, this do. Uh, da, da, da. Dish. We might end up keeping those chairs. They're kind of cute. I'm just saying. Um, you know what I'm thinking? You know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking that we do... Like a Mimi. Did you guys play... You guys ever played uh, uh what do you call it oh i didn't yeah <laughs> i didn't paint that one wall have you guys played the sims busting out on xbox or ps2 if you have y'all probably remember mimi's house right well i'm fixing to kind of recreate a mimi's house my own version bob and betty are going to be living like mimi land grab let me tell you let's give them a, a nice front door too it's kind of like a traditional See, I always go for traditional. I need to spice it up and make things different. What cycloid door? That's that's kind of cool. I like that. Ooh, or a scary door. No, I think we're good. What's that? Oh. I think we're good. And I think I put the door right in the middle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, so it's four and four. So it's gonna be odd no matter what. So maybe I should do a double door then. Yeah. Yeah, that's that'll do it right there, just like that. That doesn't look like a front door though. <laughs> okay. Well then oh let's do a red front door. Oh that's cute. I like that. I like that a lot. And we'll do some fresh stone here for the front. I'm thinking we could like Let's get rid of that. That's the old front steps. I'm thinking we could like extend it like this and create a cute little um, 
garden here, like two spaces and then, oh, we should get rid of this then. We shouldn't close it, should we? Yeah, there we go. And then what we'll do, where's the flowers? Okay. We will make this cute. Cute and fun. It's going to look like a cute club or something. Oh, I like that. Yeah, look at it, look at it. Uh, I don't really even know about these little steps anywhere off to the side. <laughs> we'll revisit it if we need to. Oh, look at these trees. I'm really appreciating these, uh, these plants they got. Oh, they got lots of trees, but not lots of, lots of plants. Oh, oh, that's small. I thought that was going to be big. Look at that. Oh, it's tiny. Okay, we'll just stick to the traditional uh, fun stuff then. Maybe we can... We'll reroute this shrubbery over here for now. Uh... I want to get some ferns going on here. With each corner piece. Oh, oh no, that went perfect. <laughs> yes, okay. These are cute too. Maybe we'll have one on the end of each thingy. Okay, I need some windows. That's my biggest problem right now. It's a very dark house. It's a very dark house, folks. There is no light in there. Ooh, we could stick to the... No... I, it'd be cool to stick to the red windows, I agree, but I feel like aesthetically that's not going to work for the, the whole house. These are cute. Cute. Maybe for a second story, though. These are my go-tos. I love these windows. These are my favorite. Okay. So we'll do two and two, and why don't we put a little... Can we do angled mirrors? Or angled windows in the Sims 1? Is that still a thing of the... Past. Oh, it is. Well, what do you know? <laughs> okay. Let's get rid of this. And replace it with. So this is where the thumbnail or the <laughs> eyedropper tool would come in handy. Big time. Oh, oh we could put paintings on, on windows, though. Good to know, I guess. Very good. Okay. So let's get actually into the living room, shall we? Yeah. Let's let's start editing this. We gotta get rid of that. We gotta get rid of that. We gotta get rid of that. Alright. We got a fresh slate here. So I feel like I feel like there's too many doors here. Oh well, it is what it is. Um what wall is going to be our anchor wall? Because we have doors here. We have windows over there. This is the kitchen. I f feel like it should be in this corner, maybe? No, we'll put a computer over there. Yeah. Yeah. How about... Oh, look at this. Look at the furniture, folks. We've got all kinds of 90s and 2000s selections. Inflatable sofas. Zebra print uh, sofas. Oh, now that's cool. I like that. Oh, we should make them real bougie. Oh, are you kidding me? This is like the Mashungas. The, you guys remember the Mashungas in the town? <laughs> I say that like you guys should just know them. You know, you know the Mashungas down the way. <laughs> yeah, them. Huh. Well, they have a similar kind of style in their house. This is cute. I like the gold. I kind of want to go for red, though. I want to keep it, you know. Hmm. What do we do? That kind of becomes blocking. This living room kind of sucks, doesn't it? <laughs> for a living room, that's kind of too crowded. No, no. You know what we could do? We could put a sofa here. We could put a big TV. No, no, no. This is an awkward living room, folks. This is just one of those awkward living rooms. So we'll just seclude. Um, yeah, we'll do that. That works, right? We can get around everything. And you know what? We'll even plop a little uh, planter in the corner. How about that? Oh, that's cute. That's cute. I like that. Let's put a couple of these out front too. Those are really cute. 
Oh, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm, I'm, I'm loving it. Yeah. Put one in that corner too. That's a cozy little corner. The front door is right here. So we know that they like their music too. So we need to make sure we got a lot of selection. But we're only doing the best for Bob and Betty movies. It would be cool to have it against the wall like that. But I feel like it's probably better. And you know what? Let's just get all birds with one stone here. Let's give them a computer space in here as well. I think that's a good idea. Probably beneficial. And you know what? Let's just move that over. There we go. See, again, with space and <laughs> uh, symmetry. Yeah. yeah. I'm a symmetry freak. Six thousand dollars for this computer. I think we're okay with just a... That seems pretty advanced for the time, too, this guy. Jeez Louise. <laughs> yeah, okay, well... You know what's crazy? Okay, sorry, let me go back there. I was just thinking about that in my head. They don't have any flat screen. Oh, I guess that's the only flat screen computer of the time in 2000. Crazy though how advanced it is. Meet Marco. <laughs> I love the little dialogues. You can, you can pause and read the dialogues as they hover there, too. They've got some pretty funny ones, some of them. Okay, so let's get him a desk lamp as well. I like that there's not much selection. I know that's funny to say, but only because I don't have to rifle through everything. Oh, that's cute. A little lamp. A little lava lamp. And a wooden old-fashioned... See, I always want to go for old-fashioned. Ah. Alright, let's just get them a traditional, you know, swivel chair. Nothing crazy. I wonder if one of these chairs will work, though. Do I need to have a computer chair? Or I, uh, like, this chair. This is cute. Yeah, this is cute. I like that. Okay, so now, 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 we need to add lamps. I don't know about a ceiling fan. I'm kind of feeling some wall lamps in here. It's a lot of selection. Yeah, let's do that. I'm just loving this music too, by the way. <laughs> Low key. select that. Yeah, we'll do it this one. <laughs> uh, what would actually go good in here? I, I feel like something unusual. Like, the wood would look good. Like, this would look good. I feel like. And that too. But I kind of want to do something. That'd be cool. Something untraditional. I'm trying to go as anti-traditional here as possible. This reminds me of like a bathroom counter. I feel like I've seen those bathrooms. I feel like I had that bathroom counter as a kid. <laughs> oh, my brother. Okay, so what if we do... Oh, this could be cool. Is that an actual counter? Oh, it is. Okay, we'll do that then. Purple and green. Y'all know I love me some purple and green. Not much green, though. <laughs> to prove my claim, but I love green and purple together. Alright, let's give them the best dang fridge. Old time fridge. And let's just give them a stainless steel fridge. This is what Bob and Betty deserve. We have to give them what they deserve. And a dishwasher. Oh, look at this. And a compactor. Y'all are getting it so good. So, so good. No time though, Bob and Betty had some some good stuff to work with here, some good equipment. Oh, we ran out of money. Rosebud. Rose green. Oh, rose. Exclamation mark this. Uh, this uh, 
I don't know if that's the right order. Nope. I did it wrong. <laughs> So we still going here. <laughs> okay, $23,000. Yay! <laughs> We're rich again. <laughs> Cool. Okay. Oh, why don't we give them an outhouse? <laughs> Save on water and energy bills this month. <laughs> okay. Oh, some little assortments. Oh, look at tea. Yes, tea time. We gotta have tea time. And they need a, a food processor, too. And I think that's about it. Look at all the stuff we got. I think that's good. Culinary offerings. Oh, we could do a buffet table instead. Haha, <laughs> look at that. Oh, that's actually a good idea. This looks more fancier, but it's blue. It's just not gonna work. Yeah, this is a good idea. Cause we have friends over. I feel like we're gonna need to cater to a lot of people at one time. So that's a great idea. Um, we need more lamps too in here. Ooh. No. Um, <laughs> let's just stick to what we know here. And this side's gonna need one too. There! Look at that. Look at that. That works, right? Look at this cute little space. I like this. It's simple. It's fun. It's all that in a bag of chips, right? What's this? Beverage sculpture. Classy. Classy. Not my cup of tea, but hey. Oh, what is this? Oh, yeah! Head in a jar! Remember head in a jar? Oh, we're gonna put that right by the front door. No, that's <laughs> There's no space. Right beside the computer. That's kind of cool. <laughs> and we need some paintings, too, because they have the room emoji, right? But that's cute. Maybe we could put a tiger somewhere. Ooh, I like that. I like that. What's this? Burby soda sign. That's cute. Uh, oh, a tribal thingy. This would be cute on this side, wouldn't it? Uh, I didn't know we had a roof. I thought I had to add a roof. Yeah, look at that. That's cute, right? Y'all like that? Now, how about for above the TV? Or behind the TV, we do a tapestry or something like that. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I like it, I like it. Okay, this has to be in here instead. I'm sorry. This is cute. Where do I go? Look at that. Oh, cool, cool. Very 90s, very 2000s. We're gonna throw that up on the. Oh, <laughs> throw that up on the wall too. I love it, I love it. Okay, so. This whole time I have been able to hear my thing. So we're out of time. Who knew? Well, we got a good start going here, don't we? I just want to keep uh, keep going here. I think we need to just carry on for, for a little while. Just a little while. Would y'all just stick with me just a little while longer? Please? That's all I ask. Oh, ooh, we'll do a beaded door. No. We want to stay 90s chic, fabulous, funky, but they're not, they're not college dorm, or they're, they're not college students in a dorm. They're a couple that have been married for a while and they just want something new and exciting and fun to uplift their lives and uh, invite some cool friends over and make some friends. So we're going to help them with that. We're going to do that for them. <laughs> uh, what was that going to be? Dining room, living room, and this is a random room. So we'll just give it a random door. Random door for a random room. <laughs> and that's for the bathroom. And these doors are all good. Uh, oh, and the door to the bathroom for them. Okay. 
we're gonna get rid of all this too. Okay. We haven't even started over there yet. I love it this so far, y'all. Look at this. This is cute. Cute and cozy, and there's enough space because Sims in this time they don't know about stuff. They run into things and they get caught. And they get yeah, they get very silly. So Oh, we could add some red curtains too. I don't know. Is there other curtains that might be uh might look a little better? Oh that's gotta go in there. Well that can go. Let's put that there. Oh, and the buffet should be in the dining room, no? Yeah, yeah. Why not? Yeah, there we go. Um, but then what are we gonna put there? A sculpture. Sculpture always works. When in doubt, throw a sculpture out. Ooh, that's cute. This place is very, 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 very modern. I must say, I must say. Maybe there's something else, like, fun we could put in there. Oh, here's some options. <gasps> How you doing? How you doing? Oh, we need a garbage can, too. Forgot about it. No, we have a compactor. But we can throw in just in case. You know merrier right birthday cake cookies a turkey <laughs> oh a turkey and a hamster maybe we'll have a ham hamster too um see this is what i'm looking for a bar a wood bar antique saloon oh this is cool yeah yeah i like that i like that now i got a little corner for drinks but and that's a big but i know we of these lamps. One there and one there should do. Thank you very much. Uh, pets. Because we're gonna adopt those strays. I'm gonna adopt those strays. I'm going to. It's gonna happen. It's gonna be a thing. We'll I'll just put them right here. Oops. Did I buy a bed? No, I didn't. But for some reason it says I bought two and I didn't. I want my money back. <laughs> that's not very nice. Okay, we need some. That's... Oh, look at this, guys. Oh, we're gonna get a parrot, too. Yeah. Oh, that's what we should have right in the middle of the, the kitchen. Yeah, Poppy the parrot. Okay, folks. This is good enough for now. I'm getting carried away. Actually, wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> oh, we don't have enough. Okay, very quickly. I gotta pee so bad. Okay, oops. Uh, <laughs> this is what happens when you drink tea all day. I actually gotta go get my refill. Okay, there we go. So now we're gonna get either a bear rug or a zebra rug. Ah, zebra rug. Yeah, zebra rug. Cool. Ah, oh, look at that. We're just, like so set. I wanna live in this house. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for tuning in to another awesome episode. I'm so happy that this is working now for me. No more glitches, just good fun times with you guys. And I'm very excited and very happy about all this. It's working very well. And in the next episode, we're gonna finish the house. We'll do the bathroom, the bedroom, master bathroom, dining room, uh, exterior and stuff. And we'll see what everything looks like with the lights on, of course, too. And we're gonna adopt those pets. I'm gonna get them off the streets. I swear to you, if this is the last thing I do, Bob and Betty are gonna be pet owners. Mark my words, it's gonna happen. <laughs> All right guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys uh, being a part of this experience with me and I'm just, it's my absolute pleasure to do this. I have so much fun doing this with you guys, sharing this experience with you guys. It is my full pleasure. So thank you so much, I love you guys. Love, peace, ta-ta. Howdy, folks. Did you like that video? Well, then why don't you go ahead and give that thumbs up a smackaroo. Don't want to miss out on the next episode? Give the subscribe button some love and make sure to turn your notifications on. That way I can give you a bell a ring, let you know when it is served. Still need more to chew on? Take a bite of my new YouTube Instagram account at Travi J Space to keep up to date with the channel's inner workings and news of upcoming projects and episodes. Thanks for watching. See you next time.